Hey, I'm Decathlon Gamer. Welcome back to Mountain Blade 2 Banner Lord, episode number 5. This time we're setting our targets on leveling up as much as possible, especially our party members, and then trying to gain as much favor as we can in a specific region so that we can hopefully acquire higher level troops and then also at some point build up enough renown locally so that we can from there obtain some sort of fiefdom at some point for us of Lycia wants his daughter found okay well he's for us of Lycia You know what, let's, let's not get into this one, especially when this is not that region that I was talking about. So we're going to move on. Got some looters here. Maybe we want to go after these looters. Where's their speed? 3.6. Our speed is 3.8. We are faster. And we just avoided the woods. We're not much faster, but they are headed the right direction. Ready back to uh, Cheras. That is the region that I think we're we're looking to move into. So, uh, with that being said, oh hello, Bestions party. You can join the fight. That's fine by me. Just don't take it over from me. And I think they might. Nope, we got there first. That's good. I think either way, we can still gain some renown, and they probably will be joining us. They are. Massive advantage on this one. My companion, this will be his very first battle. Uh, weapons and armor wise, we're gonna have to start looking into upgrading what he has uh, coming out of the loot as we continue to again, try to get the best weapons and armor for ourselves. My, oh my, that is uh, different. them are on horseback and containing a significant advantage Move. ahead of us. Forward. Move. Oh, got him. Nice. Is there anybody left standing? <laughs> that was quite quick. <laughs> All 13 kills ended up going to his party because they were faster on horseback. I did get a hit in at least. All 13 are dead, so no prisoners. No mercy, no prisoners. 41 seconds is all it took to wipe the floor with those guys. Wow, I don't even get any loot. Or gain renown, because we didn't get the credit for the kills. They did. That's lame. Well, there's 18 looters. That's a little bit of a match, isn't it? With those looters, they might actually turn on us and team up. 21 on 22. That's a little bit of a fair fight, isn't it? We'll take some casualties, but this will be a good chance to level up. At least those four are kind of gone. I'd, I'd rather have a little advantage here. There we go. We catch them. This will be a tighter battle, for sure. Nobody else around to impact it. It is nighttime that'll affect our advantage when it comes to archers and crossbowmen that we don't have much of. Okay, this is a bit of a low ground. We need to move up higher. Let's Oh. 
Yeah, this is really hard to see. Oh, we got one hit in. Alright, well that worked out pretty well. Uh, with just one casualty, and it's just a recruit. Uh, we do have two wounded. <laughs> Chenin, hurt. First fight, and he's hurt. I mean, our archer, our only archer, is hurt, but otherwise everybody's good. Horsemanship up one point. And three ready to level up. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Only took a minute. Uh, there is one survivor. If there's only one archer, then we need more. So we'll take that. Footman, this is the... Oh, spearman. We don't have any spearmen. It's good against cavalry. We need some spearmen. Ooh, our crossbowmen ready to level, level up. Okay, instead of a levy crossbowmen, just regular crossbowmen. All right. Uh, I do not like how it's very mixed. <laughs> what we have now would be nice to have kind of a group, but still. Look at that, it's got some armor. Lenny and Spearman crossbowmen. Okay, so we have a hatchet, spike mace, pitchfork. Nothing useful in there. But Chen and the Robber. Your head armor is 10. Which is better than that. You have no cloak, neither do I. A military tunic with four body armor, two leg armor, and two arm armor. That already looks to be a little bit better. Or is it? Well, the weight's better. Same tier. It offers more total points. There you go. You have nothing for gloves. Was there any gloves involved? No. Uh, ooh, nice strap shoes. That's uh, pretty nice. That is definitely better than what I have. You have an iron spatha. 94 handling. Length is 103. Thrust damage 30. That looks like a pretty good one-handed sword. Now we need to get you something more than just that sword. Need to get you a spear. Uh, not a spear. A shield. Oh, oh, well, looky here. Civilian outfit. Oh, I like that. I'm still holding a spiked mace. Is that what I have for battle? No.
Alright, so we do have some things to sell. So hide out there, but mm, no thank you. That was our four. That got away from us. Let's get out of these woods. Okay, so this is the type of area where I want to do quests because this is the kind of place that we want to purchase if it becomes possible. And we have a few vacancies. Let's go ahead and get one recruit anyway. And oh, horses. I have a Sumter horse. Alfrey is quick and maneuvers well, and has good... requires riding 10, which we definitely have. But it doesn't have a whole lot of hit points. Sturgeon Trotter, similar. Okay, we don't have riding 60, that's why we can't have these guys. I think that's what I need to wait for. Serious upgrade. And this isn't necessarily the place to be selling this stuff. Uh, this is the place to pick up the quest, though. Family feud or deliver the herd. Well, there's 400 gold for you. All right, 624 gold for what? Sheep? Three sheep. It's maybe a good opportunity to ransom our prisoner. So, Sorgard breaks skull. Okay, let's visit. Let's see, is he somebody who could be a companion? There he is. Yes, my story. Jealousy, envy of my talents. It's always been my undoing. When I was a boy, I was the best fighter in my village. You're stronger as a boy than a full-grown warrior, people would say. I'm not boasting here. That's what they'd tell me. So when I came of age, I went off to make my fortune. I started in the Vager Guard. I found that I was the only real warrior among them. They were all about marching here and there in their pretty uniforms, not pulling sword from scabbard for months on end. I told them what I thought. My captain told me to keep my mouth shut or leave, so I left. Then I joined the Skulder Bratva, the Shield Brothers. It's a good name, you know? They spent most of their time hunkering behind their shields. Ha! Me? I'd wade into the midst of the en enemy, dealing out death right and left. Well. All they had to say afterward was, why didn't you keep rakes? Uh, has no one told you that leaving a gap in a shield wall is as good as treason? Uh, that's what I would say. But I think we might have a new companion here, so I'm having no more of that. I'm on the lookout for an outfit that employs real fighters. Right now I'm between jobs, so if you've got any work for me, I'm willing to discuss it. Okay, we'll settle your debts. And we have our second companion. Just like that.
Wow. That is uh, quite the height. Which way do I want to go? I think I want to go this way. Stay out of the snow for a little while. Big battle. Bunch of prisoners. That looks like a castle siege of some kind. Yeah, those looters are pretty quick. Sheep! Hey, look at that. We could buy our three sheep we need. for on the way back. So only if you try to join the fight. I think it's a little too late. Oh, it looks like it's over. Ooh! What is Noretzi's folly? Okay, people call the Great Battle of Pendraic in the year 1077. Interesting year choice. Emperor Noretzi's led an army accompanied by Crusades and Aserai to fight a coalition of Sturgeons, Batanians, and Flandians. It was a disaster for him. He died in it, but the victors didn't fare much better. Kaladog has some thoughts about it. Nice. Well, that worked out. You're being chased, so we can get after you here. Join these guys. It's the direction we're headed anyway. I think Aaron's party is going to end up stealing all the glory. Let's just send the troops. We'll set this one out. Oh, we lost one recruit out of it, but we did get some kills, and we have a couple regular, uh, couple ready to level up, and that was what I was hoping for. Oh, that bushwhacker. An archer. I would gladly take you prisoner and recruit you in. Okay, Vlandian recruit. We need footmen or crossbowmen. The crossbowmen are doing quite well. But we certainly do need some footmen. We only have one right now who's about to level up. We need infantry or spearmen. I don't have any infantry. I do have one spearman so far. This is good though, we are starting to expand our ranks a little bit in terms of quality and oh my goodness. Yes sir, we've picked up mother load in this one. Woodland garments, butter, and this longbow. Requires bow 15, we have that. So tier 3 bow, speed is about the same. Pierce is a bit stronger, accuracy is better, and the missile speed. Nice. Okay. I'm not even sure who this is going to. Vinter. Go to Vinter. Alright, quest complete. 
20 in all. I'd rather go after the 11 and 4 than the, or 11 and 5. Eleven are the slowest, those five are pretty dang quick. If they match our speed. Oh, they did Wow. As far away as they are, they they did group together. Okay. Twenty one and sixteen. We certainly have an advantage, and we are stronger than them. Should have no problems, but we might lose a couple in a fight like this. Already in pretty good grounds. Just get a little closer here. Oh. Can we... Hey. Why can't I arm my bow? Is it because it's snowing? Or is there something wrong with this bow and the ammunition I have selected? Kill them all! Ah, uh, see, I'm terrible on horseback. We have lost a couple troops here. Okay, the Renown and Morel is good. Three wounded, one dead. It's just the Watchman dead, so that's okay by me. A couple of recruits ready to, le ready to level up. They do have a few survivors, so we can take them prayer. Oh, peasants. No, oh, thank you. Prisoners, yes. Imperial archer. Oh, excuse me. Footman, crossbowman. No, let's. Take another crossbowman. I'd like to recruit that guy. There we go. Indelia the Wanderer. Is it stranger? Who are you? My family had debts, so I joined the army. I guess I always liked men's work more than women's work. The legions took hill women as scouts. I was never the Heidi sneaky type, so I did what I did to be in the spear line. Dressed as a man, of course, weren't too weren't difficult to do. Not hard to fool them in. Bow my breast and watch where I pissed. Was easy. Well, you know what happened, great lord. Nerezis led the legions to their deaths. I was there. Our syntagma didn't see the battle, but was part of the route. That was the end of army life for me. Don't care for glory hounding, lords leading me to my death, but I still like to fight. Yeah, the merchants give me jobs, but I'm not sure I care much for guarding caravans. A lot of sitting around listening to boring talk about prices. All right, well, just like that, we've picked up three companions. That's pretty amazing that it took that long to get any. I don't know if it was the Renown or if I just wasn't looking properly. Probably not properly. And that's that's kind of the trick to these things. But once you know how they've got things set up, stuff becomes really easy.
Oh, that is our cavalryman. Cavalryman, isn't it? Yeah, he's a Flandian knight now. Nice. Okay. Okay, we do have some stuff to sell. Let's go ahead and head into Provin, where we will be ending this episode. A couple quests here. And nobody worthwhile to recruit. But we're going to make a little bit of money here. We are down to 4,600 in recruiting our companions recently. right back to what I had essentially or do we get something that is equipped for This is bow, but I don't understand why we don't have anything. So let's go ahead and spend a little bit. We'll have to get the step bow. Army of poachers, overpriced raw materials. Alright, well that quest we can't take on when we already have a quest of that type active. Good to know. And that's going to do it for this episode. I'm the Gamer. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to hit that like button. I'll see you next time. Be safe everybody. Bye for now.